And here comes Patrick Swiss, P-Swiss. Using his whole body on the push. Me and Danny met P-Swiss when he was a grommet in Montreal. He, ha he has a Sector 9 tattoo actually on his waist. He has a Sector 9 tattoo on his hip for where yeah. he Little marked where he got a, a severe hipper and lost a bunch of skin. 91 hand toe side? Yeah. Ripping through Angie's curve. Whoa. That looked pretty fast. Flying out of the curve, coming down to turn two here. P Swiss is going to be coming by the announcer's booth, and he is in a full tuck, and he looks fast. Here he comes, Max. Ripping through. Flying, looking tight. Wow. Clean, very clean. Awesome. I have just also heard through a couple people that Zach's time has not been posted yet, so we still do not know if he is up there or not. Right. Yeah. Patrick, so, so far back on his board. I don't know. I wonder how fast Zach was going. Patrick just got clocked in at 65 miles an hour. Keeping it together through the right kink into the left 180. Give a little scrubby right in the middle there. Everybody crowded at the top of the hill looking for the times to dump in and at the live feed as well. Patrick coming out of the last turn. Zip it through the finish line. We will wait to hear and see who qualified for or who finished first, I guess, in the top 10 shootout. Right. Who gets the tires. Very cool. Michelin tires offering up the prize today for the top 10 shootout. An awesome first day of skating. What do you guys think about today's race? We did qualify for the top 10 shootout. And uh, tomorrow we got some racing going on. Oh my gosh. I just heard over the radio that Patrick's sister has won the shootout by two seconds. The is now closed to all skateboarders and open to traffic. All right. So we don't have the official word, but we did hear over the radio. That P Swiss beat everybody by at least two seconds? Yep, that's what I have heard from Louie. Two seconds. Uh, sure that is fast, man.